it's really subdued. I'm really struggling to get an aroma. Way back a year ago. Hello, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Modern Mondays. And we've got a beer that I picked up from Booths. And this is Little Valley. And it's a dark veil, rich and roasted vanilla porter. It's coming in at 4.5%. Great beer, runs deep. There you go, there's a bottle. So yeah, so like I say, I picked up this, this sorry, <laughs> I picked this up from Booths. Um, I think it's about two pound a bottle. And I think it might have been in one of the offers where you get like four for free. Um, so Little Valley Brew, I have had their beers before. They were formed back in 2005, high up on the Pennine moorland of Crag Vale, West Yorkshire. But the Little Valley story actually starts before this, back in 1999, high up in the much larger valley of Kathmandu, Nepal. Um, great things happen when you mix right ingredients, although our beer is made using the finest malts, hops, water and yeast. It's our people that's the most vital ingredient of all. I love that, I think that's fantastic. What they're saying is, we don't take our brewing journey alone. It's only possible through tasting and testing, listening to our customers and loving every step of the way. It's this that guides what we do. Let us show you brewing the Little Valley way. And, and they can go on about how they source it, the mill it, the mashing, the, the whole process is on there. But it's just absolutely fantastic. Um, beers that they've got they do pails they do what's that one a, a gingery one light and gingery a, a light and refreshing pale light and hoppy pale uh fruity and hazy they do this one the dark veil they do a bitter um they do the todd's blonde is one that i've had before i think i got that from waitrose they do a rich and roasted stoodly stout and then they do a tart and tangy cherry saison that sounds absolutely fantastic so yeah so it's a modern monday little valley let's get into the beer i'm really looking forward to this because that um, top one was a great beer so i'm really really looking forward to this so like i say see what it looks like get the aroma then get the taste oh that's pouring really really nice it's like a real dark brown rich brown in color as i'm pouring that I do think the bottle conditioned from memory of the top one but that there you go that's all going in all in all in that looks stunning nice creamy looking head just off white looks dark deep like a dark deep dark brown in color for this i mean what rich and roasted vanilla porter so what am I expecting? I'm expecting some sweet notes, some coffee, some chocolate, roasted. Maybe not so much roasted because then I'm pushing stout territory. So definitely chocolate. It's all very subdued. It's really subdued. I'm really struggling to get an aroma. I don't think it's too cold, but I'm really struggling to get an aroma, I'll be honest. So it's really, it's so, 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 so subtle just picking up on a little bit of even a roasted malt a sweet chocolate it's so so subdued okay let's go in for the flavor cheers it's nice enough it's nice enough it's very subtle vanilla a little bit of chocolate but not enough for me, not enough. There's not enough, I don't know, it's not very complex. It's, it's, it's just, it, everything's very subtle. It's a little bit thin on the mouthfeel, I'll be honest, 4.5%. It just feels a little bit thin on the mouthfeel. And then I suppose that backs up that dark brown. It's not very, it's not black in color, which I'd expect from most porters. Um, there is a vanilla note, so yeah, tick that box. But the the roast, the roasted, the coffee, the chocolate is very subdued. It's it's pulled back, and it just feels very light in body. 
He's really light body. It's in the 4.5% and it's lying body and it just feels like I've had better, better porters at that ABV and there's a slight bitterness there from some sort of, you know, from the malt rather than the hop. There's no hop character, which is absolutely fine, which you wouldn't expect anyway. But I just wanted more. I just wanted more from the malts that I'm not really getting. It's a bit, I probably, you know, my face says it, I'm a bit disappointed that the malt notes aren't there as much as I wanted them to be. Um, it just feels really pulled back um, in that character. I mean, I, I, I know from, from homebrewing that pale malt is, you know, the majority of it, but I just, I don't know, I don't know. Maybe they could have pushed them dark roasted malts a bit more um, for me just to pull out a bit more character, a bit more complex flavours. I mean, it's, it's, it's an okay beer. It's not a great beer. Um, I won't mind trying it on the cask, see if it's different. But yeah, it's it's an okay beer. Dark Vale, I was really looking forward to this as well. Um, what does it say on the bottle? If anything, there's lots of words there, but it doesn't actually say anything on there. It's just all ingredients let's see what it says on this side at little valley we make beer that takes you further look past the scene go beyond what's been and focus on what matters quality taste character that's what it's all about since we set off in 2005 we've stayed true to our guiding principles to make great beer to enjoy the journey and to share our passion with everyone we meet along the way the journey dark veil vanilla porter invites you to explore a full landscape of flavor at your own pace it's, my, it's subjective, isn't it? It's my personal taste. Feel free to stroll gentle slopes of rich, dark textures, textures and pass by subtle hints of vanilla and licorice. Oh, it, for me, it's all subtle. Everything in that glass is subtle. Um, yeah, it's just me. Yeah, that's just, you know, subjective. I just wanted a little bit more. But, yeah, I'd, I'd go and try it. Go and give it a go. Because, like I say, we're all different. We pick up on different flavours. For me, I just want a little bit more. Maybe my expectations were high. Um, it's okay. It's okay. I might look at something else. I might look at their stout over the porter. You know, that might just satisfy that, what I'm looking for. So, there you go. Anyway, thanks for watching. Cheers. And I'll see you on the next one. I've been dreaming on in my head like I've seen it A life worth living is a life with meaning I'll do what I love till my heart stops beating